I've known people that get so into theology that they don't believe that it's right to use the power of God unless they know and understand everything. That, my friend, is a mistake. There is always more to know about God than I will ever know. And I always reserve the right to change my mind as I get a bigger glimpse of God. Now, you may not understand everything there is to know about electricity and how a light bulb works. But thank God you don't need to reinvent the light bulb every time you need light. You just simply walk over and in faith turn on the switch because you know that the light bulb and the electricity are there and they are working. Even more important, you don't need to understand what takes place with a healing in order to be healed. I've seen people healed that had uh, a little bit of faith, not a lot, but they, they just had enough like that grain of mustard seed where it could come in and God found an opening and God could heal their mind and their body. I tell you, my friends, that God is a source of ever-renewing life. We will never know, even if we spent this entire lifetime studying Scripture, all there is to know about God's ever-renewing life. We just simply have to be open to it, don't we? We have to turn that switch and have faith that when we turn that switch through prayer, that God will be there. It doesn't really matter what church you go to. It doesn't matter who your pastor is or your rabbi. The main thing is your faith in the one God. And when we come to that realization, which often happens in the clergy later on in life, they realize that God is much bigger than any single concept, that God is accessible to all. So if you've been working hard to understand God, to understand how you can have God in one particular way, I ask you this weekend to give it a rest and just realize that God is connected with you and you're connected with God and that God's never going to abandon you. God's not going to forsake you. That God loves you and God is waiting and willing to Hear your call, when you call, with faith and with a willingness to follow divine direction. You awaken every cell of your mind and your body to God's ever-renewing life. And it comes, and it comes in waves that will just give you a sense of joy and euphoria. And you'll know, without a doubt, yeah, there's God again. And what a joyous feeling that is to greet your old friend that you might have turned your back on for a while, but to know that your old friend never turned the divine back towards you. God bless you, my friend.